Create and modify announcements in Blackboard Learn. In this video, you'll learn how to modify an existing announcement, create a new announcement, reorder announcements, and set the announcements tool as the course entry page. If you're working in a Blackboard course shell that has been based on a college template or a system template, it's very likely that you may already see a standard announcement in there, perhaps one that lets students know that if they're seeing that announcement, the instructor has not yet modified the course shell. Let me begin by showing you how to modify an existing announcement, such as the example shown here. What you would do is click the little Action Links drop-down, which are these double-down pointing arrows, and then select Edit. The announcement will open up, and now you can change the message. I'm going to copy and paste some text in that I already had existing from a different course. Okay, as you can see, I've replaced the standard verbiage in the existing announcement with some new text. Notice that the text is short and sweet and to the point, and it has a bulleted list or a numbered list, and instructions on exactly what the students are supposed to do next. In this case, um, when they're all done checking their messages and watching the video, they're supposed to click the Getting Started button in the course menu and then work through the How to Get Started Learning module. Once you've done that, you can come down here and you can change the dates that this announcement is available. If I click the radio button for date restricted, I can select display after and display until dates. I can also click the checkbox to send a copy of this announcement as an email to students. Then scroll down and click submit. If I wanted to select and create a second announcement, I could click create announcement button and pretty much follow the same process. It's easy to reorder announcements. To the left of each announcement title, you'll see a little up and down pointing arrow. Move your cursor over this up and down pointing arrow until it turns into a cross with arrowheads pointing in all four directions. Then click and drag. That's all there is to reordering announcements. One thing we always recommend is that instructors make the Announcements tool the course entry page for their course. It's easy to do this. First, make sure that the Announcements tool is showing to students on your menu. In other words, there should not be a little gray box with a line through it. The students should be able to see the Announcements button on the menu. Next, scroll down and from the control panel click Customization and then Style. Scroll down a little bit and one of the options will be to select the course entry point. Be sure that Announcements is selected here. Then click Submit. Now, when your students enter the course, the first thing that they will always see is the most current announcement. Now, you're ready to create and modify your own announcements in Blackboard Learn.